Hi friends. Well, it's Friday evening and uh, that means that you did not get a video on Friday morning. It's been a busy week. Lynn and I are going to the United States to rejoin our RV in a couple of weeks and uh, we have a lot of things going on before we leave like getting the house ready for us to be gone for several months and uh, you know, just little maintenance things. Salitre, you know what that is if you live in Mexico. It's uh, um, concrete walls kind of get like cancer and they start deteriorating and you gotta keep after it. Anyway, uh, we also are doing a lot of uh, dental work and uh, I'm having some medical tests, nothing terrible, serious going on, just some, um, some uh, preventive maintenance. Getting that stuff all done because when we go to the United States, we, we do have Medicare and a supplement, so it's not a financial threat like it used to be before we had Medicare, but um, we actually prefer to get these things done in Mexico even though we have to pay out of pocket for them when we go to private uh, hospitals. Uh, rather than even pay the copay or the uh, deductible or whatever you happen to get billed in the United States can be more than the full price here in Mexico. Anyway, um, like I said, been busy. Uh, was going to get a video out this morning and I had people coming to professionally clean some of the furniture. And another guy who came and uh, spent some time explaining to me how a new TV service might work. And uh, just anyway, lots of stuff going on. So I'm finally going to be able to sit down and take a minute to upload this. I don't know if you can hear that pounding next door. I, I hope it's not as bothersome in the video as it is to this year. The house next door is vacant and uh, some people from Mexico City bought it and they're having some renovations done. And it's been going on for a while and I'm pretty sure they're going to be done real soon but um, every once in a while you hear them pounding or doing something. And I sat down to talk to you guys and he started pounding. Such is life. Have a good day. Well, your new hairstyle looks fantastic. <laughs> Are you ready for the yes. picture? Yes. It's been video the whole time. Oh. Well, I'm back at the new hospital in San Antonio where Lynn got her cracked rib taped up. The new Guadalajara Pharmacy is open and they've gotten up a sign that uh, says they'll take most U.S. insurance and a list of their services. I'm here at the new hospital in San Antonio, Jalisco, Mexico today for a procedure you're going to figure out in a moment. This hospital has only been open a few months and we're going to go into a room where there's a brand new state-of-the-art machine. It's the big donut for a CAT scan. The CAT scan was 2,870 pesos, which is 141 US dollars. And that's the full price. It's not the insurance copay. It's the total entire price of the CAT scan, 141 U.S. dollars. And I paid for that with my Capital One credit card. I'll get 1.5% back. You guys got to get one of those Capital One cards. Look down here below in my video description and get my link.
Exchange rate was 19.7, the current market exchange rate to the nanosecond. Please enjoy my stories or whatever else might be on my mind today. Well, it's just uh, playing around with my video camera day. This is my 50 power optical zoom and I'm still uh, pretty impressed with a $198 camera that can do this. If you want to know the rest of the specs, it's in the description down below the video. These are cormorants, and they've kind of taken over this tree. About half of them aren't even there right now. They're out fishing. They go fishing, then they come back and they dry themselves sitting in that tree and they spend the night in that tree. The lake is full of water hyacinth. Let me zoom out here. It's out there several miles. Water hyacinth, we call it lirio here, and it floats. The wind blows it around to different parts of the lake. I did this herky-jerky time-lapse for you. This is 30 minutes of time-lapse, and you can see how far this stuff moves the wind's blowing it to the east now. Oh, look how many cormorants have come home to the tree for the evening. Same camera. It also takes still pictures. And I haven't enhanced these pictures. This is just the way they came out of the camera. I haven't color corrected them or increased the saturation of the color. Just walked around the yard and took pictures of mostly in my cactus gardens. That's a rosemary bush. And here's some mushrooms that I thought were some kind of fungus. I thought those were really beautiful. They're on a dead tree. Oh, well, speaking of dead trees, I was in Hokotepec the other day, and the wind had blown down this huge tree. This thing was unbelievable big. It was a really powerful windstorm day about uh, two weeks ago. Look at the size of the root pad that it ripped up out of the ground. Well, I didn't have any dog content for this video, so I dug out this selfie of me and a famous dog. If you don't recognize him, that's okay. I'll give you a hint. It was last January in Arizona. Hey, if you like me, give me one of those thumbs up. And please subscribe and hit that little bell so you know when I post next. Please share me with your friends on social media. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed what was on my mind today.